Welcome to Food Lovers UK YouTube channel. Hope you enjoy our delicious recipes. The brownies I am making today with my 14 year old daughter are delicious and perfect treat for kids especially around Christmas. Okay, let's get started. First of all, we're going to make the brownies and then we will decorate it with Christmas decorations afterwards. So to make your brownies, you will need plain flour, caster sugar, milk chocolate, butter, eggs, cocoa powder, baking powder, vanilla extract and walnuts. We will start by melting our milk chocolate in the microwave. So I melted the chocolate in the microwave for about a minute and I stirred it. And now we're going to add the butter into our chocolate mixture. We're going to stir it up a bit and now we're going to melt the chocolate and the butter in the microwave for about a minute or so until it's completely melted. So I melted the butter and chocolate in the microwave and as you can see it's all melted together. We're going to stir it for couple seconds or so until there aren't any butter lumps so now I'm going to pour my chocolate and butter into a mixing bowl so we're now going to add our vanilla extract into our mixture and then we're going to add the sugar gradually into our mixture and you want to mix it all together very well. Mix it. You want to add little by little so it doesn't go everywhere. Now we will add the last bit of sugar as well and mix it all together. So my mom's gonna help me stir the mixture a bit better. Okay, we're going to leave this aside now and whisk the eggs together in a different bowl. I'm going to crack the eggs now. Okay, I'm going to whisk the eggs together now. I want to do it pretty fast. Does this have to be fluffy? Uh, no, not really, but it needs to be done a little bit more. Can you do, can you do the rest of it? Yeah, I'll do it. Okay, so now we're going to pour in the egg mixture into the chocolate mixture. You want to add a little by little and then start stirring. Now, it's kind of a bit stiff. So you want to like stir it really well. I got my mom to help me a bit because it was very hard. And now we will add a little bit more. Okay, so now you want to get your baking powder 
and put it into your bowl of plain flour and then you want to get your bowl of cocoa powder and also add it to your flour mixture and now we're going to stir it in a bit get it all nice and mixed Alright guys, so now while my mum is mixing that, I will grab a sieve and we're going to sieve the flour mixture into our chocolate mixture. You want to sieve the flour to get rid of any lumps so your butter is nice and smooth. So my mum stirred the rest of the flour mixture into our chocolate mixture and I'm just going to do the last bit of stirring. And the last thing you want to do is add your walnuts into the mixture. And now we're going to stir it all together. Okay so now I'm going to grease the butter on the baking paper. Okay, so now my mom's going to pour the mixture onto the tray. Shake the tray a little bit to get rid of any air bubbles. You will need to bake your brownies for 40 to 45 minutes in 180 degrees. So now that our brownies are baked, we're going to transfer it onto a tray and, we're go and my mom is going to cut it into triangles. Okay, so as you can see, the top of it is nice and crusty and the inside is really gooey and we're gonna have a taste mm. you can definitely taste the walnuts which is really nice it's, the crunchiness at the top just makes it really good and it's nice and gooey and soft on the inside so i definitely recommend you all to try it so we're going to be using these candy canes i'm going to push the candy cane in to the brownies to make it look like a Christmas tree. There we go. So now I'm going to get my decorations ready. We also got these gold ones and we got these red, green and white ones. Of course you can use any decorations that you want. And just to make it easier, I'm going to put them all into these little bowls. So my mom made buttercream icing and we put some red food down here. It looks a bit pink but it's okay and we left this one just plain white. You can dye any colour you want and then we put them into piping bags. Now you have to be very careful when you're cutting it since you don't want to have a big um, cut over here because then it will be very hard to pipe it and we just made a small cut like that. Alright, so now we're going to add the sprinkles. I'm going to use some of this golden uh, white one first because it looks nice. Get sprinkles those. Just sprinkle it. This is looking very 
very nice. And now we're gonna have the red ones. Now let's add the green. Alright, lastly we're gonna add some of these um mini candy cane sprinkles. Um I don't know, I think I'm gonna place these because they might just go everywhere. Have fun making these brownies! If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe as well as sharing it with your friends. Thank you very much for watching this video. Have a nice day.